What you're seeing here is an elevator design built completely with make block parts. This mechanism is a continuous elevator, which means that the entire elevator is only driven with one singular belt. Compared to a cascade design, each level of the elevator will move before the other one, which means the load on the motor will increase the higher you go, making the consistency of the elevator imbalanced. Unfortunately, this elevator still couldn't reach the top of the scoring position. These are the longest piece that came with the kit. If you want to score on the highest position in this field, you will have to extend these beams or build your own custom elevator, in which we'll be showing you how to do it in the future videos. One of the weaknesses for this elevator is the accuracy. The slider blocks will lose its accuracy after a period of time, creating a gap between the elevator and the frame. One of the strengths for this design is that it is very easy to build. No additional materials needed and you can build it straight from the kit parts. If this is your first time competing, this design is able to achieve the needed functionalities. We are also able to improve the efficiency by using an encoder motor. We can preset all the desired locations, add fine adjustments when we are docking the game pieces. We can also add fine movements to the chassis when we are scoring, allowing an easier control for the drivers. In the upcoming videos, we will also be designing a more complex elevator design utilizing lightweight box tubings and 3D printed parts. In the meantime, if you have any questions, feel free to comment down below in my YouTube channel. You can also visit my website for more in-depth information on these mechanisms. Thank you for watching.